What's good, family? It's your boy, Trav Coop from Generation of Wealth Vibes, and I'm hoping everybody is having a blessed, amazing day. Of course, I had to come back and hit you with another play here. All right, so I'm constantly doing research all the time um, on these different uh, platforms, these e-commerce platforms. So I've seen today a setup for a nice play, and I know that I've probably thrown away a lot of money over the years not listening to what Gary V told us or me because I'm a follower of Gary V years ago about the collectibles and the trading cards those sports cards eBay just updated their platform today with new tools and a guide to make it easier for people with trading cards to upload their portfolio and make it easier to list eBay sees this trend and now they want to cash in on this collectible card game. Now me personally, I don't deal in the cards, but I do books and sometimes through um, error, collectible cards are thrown into those bins or whenever I do my pickups. So I would, I mean over the years, I've probably tossed, you know, tens of thousands of cards in the trash. But now that I know that this is a big market. I read in an article that the card trading industry is worth $5 billion, guys. That's an opportunity for us all to get in. And just in the first quarter alone, eBay has already done over $1 billion. So with eBay updating their tools, making it easier, they see this wave and this trend is about to go up. So they're trying to put their net in the water to catch some of that money as this trend continues to go upward. So here's how it relates to you. Whenever you're out, popular places will be Facebook Marketplace, garage sales, uh, anytime you're at any thrill stores or anything, make sure to check out the collectible trading cards. They said in the article, uh, basketball is starting the uh, basketball rookie cards, Kobe Bryant card, Tom Brady, Michael Jordan car, like they're going for over a hundred thousand dollars, guys. So make sure you do your research because most of the time at these garage sales, uh, it may be some older parents. And I mean, I'm not talking about the older folks because I'm up there too. Because <laughs> I didn't know anything about trading cards, so I know I throw away probably a lot of money over the years. So I can't, you know, poke fun at them, but. People are out there selling stuff and their kids maybe just had it when they were smaller or their grandkids and basically they don't want to deal with it. So it's potentially a lot of money out there because a lot of people don't know about this trading card industry or the collectible game, the collectible card game, you know, whether it's baseball cards, basketball, football, soccer. Guys, make sure to do your research. You can potentially get uh these cards for free or pennies you know very cheap and sell them for tens or hundreds of thousands of dollars so make sure to keep your eyes open you know my job is to provide you guys with plays to increase or create additional streams of income so if you hadn't already go check your boy out on instagram at travis underscore gwv and if you hadn't hit the subscribe button yet I would greatly appreciate it if you did like and comment. Let me know what you guys want to see next. I'm going to keep them coming. We're trying to make sure everybody is up. And let's lend a hand to help people create additional streams of income and build that generation of wealth. It's your boy, Trav Coop. I'm out. See you on the next plane.